partnership between Kino Border Initiatives and Brophy College Preparatory's high school students is working to raise funds for those recently depo deported in Sonora, Mexico. Cronkite News reporter Cassidy McDonald visited the Brophy campus to learn more about their record-breaking fundraiser. For the past several years, Brophy College Preparatory has had an ongoing partnership with Kino Border Initiatives. The purpose is to serve those who are deported to Nogales, Sonora. There is a soup kitchen. Meals are served two times a day, 365 days a year. Last year, we served over 46,000 meals. There is a shelter for women and children. We offer minor medical care. Every month, Brophy sends around a dozen students to Sonora, Mexico to volunteer and learn more about the struggles along the border. It was determined that Brophy students would greatly benefit from trips down to KBI to help serve, to learn about the complex issue of immigration. I really wanted to get into, involved in it because Brophy really stresses the importance of being in solidarity with the marginalized, especially um, right now. Senior Matthew Chavira says the most rewarding part of his experience with KBI in Sonora was speaking with those who had recently been deported. The most important thing is you listen to them and you hear that they trust you enough to tell you their stories and, of, and how they got here and you, you just learn and there you realize these aren't just immigrants, these are mothers, children, families that are just coming over and that they are fleeing violence and poverty. In many cases, it's a life or death situation. Brophy held a fundraiser dinner for KBI this past weekend. Powell says they exceeded their goal of $130,000 by raising an estimated $150,000 and counting. We need the funds to keep, to help feed the people and to pay the rent. Hal hopes the partnership with Brophy will expose young people to learn about tough issues. Hopefully they will be able to bring some resolution in the future because we as a country have not dealt very well with immigration. It really prompted me to want to advocate for these um, recently deported immigrants um, and give a voice to the voiceless. The most important things that we can do is share their stories so people know why they're coming over here. The students share their experience with fellow students and others within the Jesuit community. In Phoenix, Cassidy McDonald, Cronkite News. KBIA KBI also has an advocacy committee that follows the current changes in our country's immigration policies in an effort to help inform immigrants and those recently deported about changes in legislation and understanding their rights.